So again I repeat the fifth problem. On 1st Jan 2005, Mr. Author and Mr. Book entered into a partnership on the following terms. Author and Book are to contribute 50,000, 30,000 capital. Then profit and losses are to be shared 3 to 2. Interest on capital 5%, interest on drawing 2%. Author is to get a salary of 500. Come, uh, book is to get a commission of 2% on net profit of the firm before charging any of the above. On 31st December 2005, their trading profits before giving effect to the above term was 60,000. So 60,000 is the profit before making any of the above adjustments. All these adjustments we have to do in PL appropriation account. During the year, Mr. Author was withdrawn 1,000 and book 500 from the firm on which interest is to be charged for the whole year. So here it is given drawings. Drawings are 1500 and interest is to be charged for the whole year. If that sentence was not given then we would have charged interest on drawing for half year. Always we will make the assumption that drawings are made in the middle of the year so we calculate interest on drawing for half year. But here it is specifically even for full year. So we take full year. You are required to prepare profit and loss appropriation account for the year ended 31st December 2005 and partner's capital account in the cases when their capitals are fixed and their capitals are fluctuating. Exactly similar problem. First we have to make PLL appropriation account. Then we have to make partner's capital account. So this is problem number 5. How much is the profit before making any adjustment? 60,000. By interest on drawings, that is author and book. The drawings made by the partners are 1,500 into the rate of interest is 2%. So it comes to 20 rupees and 10 rupees. Interest on capital. Author and book. That is 50,000, 30,000. So interest is 5%. It is 2500 and 1500. Then salary to author. Salary of author is 500 per month into 12. 6000. Commission to book. Commission to book is 2% of 60,000. It comes to 1200. Then net profit. Balancing figure. Transferred to author book. See the total of the credit side, it comes to 60,030. Out of this, subtract all the debit items, you will get 48,830. The net profit divisible profit is 48,830. Now 48,830 into the profit sharing ratio is 3 is to 2, 3 by 5. Three by five, two by four, twenty nine, two ninety eight. Twenty nine, two ninety eight, nineteen, five thirty two.
these are the profits divisible profits between author and book now case one If the partner's capitals are fixed, if the partner's capitals are fixed, first case, then we have to make partner's current account. Author, book, author and book. By balance, uh, not balance. We don't have any balance in the beginning of the year because they have started the business during the current year only. So directly we will take current account, all the balances by interest on capital. It is 2500 and 1500. Then by salary. Salary is paid to author 6000. By commission. Commission is to be paid to book 1200. Then we will have by P and L appropriation account profit. The profit is 29,298 and 19,532. Debit side to drawings. The drawings are 1500 to interest on drawings 20 and 10 so we have taken to balance carried down balancing figure bravo what is the total of the credit side? Credit side authors total 37,798. From this, deduct the two items. Uh, you will get 36,778. Now book. The total is 22,232. Minus these two items, you will get 21,722. That's it. So we have prepared the current account for author and book. Now, partner's capital account. The partner's capital account will remain same. By bank because they have started the business at the beginning of this current year. So 50,000, 30,000. To balance carried down. By balance brought down. 50,000, Same balance will be taken at the beginning of the year and end of the year. No difference. This is the method of maintaining capital accounts under fixed capital method. Under fixed capital method, two accounts. Partner's current account and partner capital account. After this, we have to make second case. The second case is case 2. If the partners capitals are fluctuating. Waha par partners capital fixed tha. Or yaha par partners capital fluctuating. The partners capital account. 
only one account will be made that is capital account no current account author book author and book by bank how much capital they have introduced at the beginning of the year that is 50000 30000 Now we take all the items that were credited here. Interest on capital is capital. By interest on capital, that is 2500. By salary. By commission. By PNL appropriation account profit. 29,298 and 19,532 2 drawings 1,500 2 interest on drawings 20 and 10 2 balance carried down balancing figure by balance brought take the totals now the total is 87,798 from 87,798 subtract the two items 86,778 Now here, 52, 232. Subtracting 51, 722. That's all. That is the partner's capital accounts are fixed and here it is partner's capital account are fluctuating. Only the difference is capital, opening capital we have taken here. But here in current account, we have not taken opening capital account. Fixed capital is kept separately.